Before the game, we uh, we talked a couple of days ago about this being a big match between the numbers one and three of the league. But when we saw it for real, it, it, it was it went pretty easy for you. <laughs> um, Except I, the end. <laughs> yeah, I think the first half was uh, was really well for us. Um, we controlled the game, and uh, yeah, we should have scored even more goals. Um, second half was a little bit more. Um, back and forward all the time and uh, they got a goal and then it's always uh, dangerous when you when you don't close the game and uh, we had the chances before to make it 3-0 but at the end we won and uh, yeah five in a row is, is not a bad start two goals in one minute uh, including one of your goals that uh, that's a high achievement yeah it was and it was uh, it was nice um, the first one was a good attack and uh, uh, Dirk finished it off and um, the second one was also a nice goal a very good pass from Jens so um, it was good can you uh, tell us um, if, if it's indeed a big strength that you see Jens Tornstra and Steven Berger switching sides and the opponent doesn't know who, who's where at what moment. Yeah, of course it is. Uh, both of them is, uh, is very intelligent footballers. And um, as you said, uh, I think uh, the opponents today uh, had a lot of trouble for really finding out uh, where they were. And um, yeah, that was a, a big strength for us. And um, yeah, I'm happy for, uh, for the guys and, uh, and the win. Were you really eager to, to score another goal because in the last two matches you didn't do it for Feyenoord uh, and, and now you got one uh, again? Yeah, as I told you, the most important thing is that we keep winning uh, and we do it as a team. And today again, uh, we showed great team spirit and um, to score a goal is, is always very nice, especially at home, uh, always to, to prove yourself that, uh, that you do your best. And um, yeah, to score a goal is, is, is also very important for, uh, for a striker. It got a bit hectic at the, at the end of the match um, and that was unnecessary, I think, because if you've killed the game earlier, you, you could have had an easy walk towards a busy schedule. Yeah, and we should have. Uh, I had a big chance, very big chance. Uh, after that, Simon has a good chance as well. And as I said, when you don't kill the game, it's always going to be uh, going to be tough the last 10 minutes. And they, they got a goal and it was a bit frustrating because uh, they didn't deserve it. Um, so. Uh, yeah, it was a bit stress for like five, six minutes, but then uh, Kalim scored the winning goal and it was a big relief for, for, all, for all of us and uh, also for the fans, I think. And now it's time for the big match, Man United. Uh, did you watch their, their game this weekend or were you indeed sleeping? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they, they also teased me here on the team because I said I was sleeping. But, uh, I it was in the afternoon. Yeah, it was. Uh, I, I, saw, I, saw, uh, I saw it, of course. Uh, it's important also to, to analyse uh, the team we're going to play against. Uh, even though you, you watch them every, every weekend, now you need to be a little bit more specific. And um, yeah, maybe uh, they don't bring the, the best confidence after a tough loss. Um, so uh, we have to yeah, take our chances. Uh, we have nothing to lose. It's a big team, so uh, we have to give 100% and uh, hopefully get the uh, three points. What do you prefer? Do you prefer them coming with all the big stars, the biggest names, or that they perhaps keep some people on the side and you have a bigger chance to win next Thursday? I think even even though they put some of the stars on the bench, it's still going to be stars who's going to who's going to play anyway. Uh, you see on the wings, uh, they have Rashford, Memphis, uh, Lingard, and they are not even playing uh, every game. So um, no matter how they play, it's going to be tough. And uh, yeah, we really really got to do our best, and, and hopefully everything is going to going to be well, and then we have a chance. There's always a chance. There is always a chance. <laughs> That's football.